Hello to everyone watching this footage. It's Leviathan here again, and I severely apologize for me going past my two-week time limit inadvertently. For this footage, I will explain the sixth main member of the Scantily Six villain team of a character known as Strand. So bear with me if you uh, want to uh, understand this character and such, just bear with me as I try to read her backstory, basically. Just bear with me, and I promise to make it fair. Strand, number one, the beginning. Created and copyrighted by Levi Corsi Ames at August 4, 2015. To begin the story, we start traveling across New York City until we start observing a little girl watching TV in her house. This story is particularly about her. Her name is Allison Strand. She has blue eyes, appears highly adorable, and currently has no hair. She was born with a condition that kept her from growing hair, causing her to become overly self-conscious. Since she was two years old, she was fascinated with the legendary story of Rapunzel and would do anything to be more like her. By the present day, Allison was hired by a group of scientists to be the main volunteer for a new shampoo product that can make her grow hair. After using the shampoo, she sprouted deep purple hair with unique capabilities, and due to her gradually developed ego, she used her hair to destroy the lab and eventually started attempting to demolish New York City. Meanwhile, Madame Shea was working in her lab when she realized that a series of long purple hair appeared out of nowhere and started crumbling her home and workplace at Blader Tech Tower. After being transported to her next opponent at the last second, Madame Shear said to her, Who are you, and why are you doing this? Look at that! It's Madame Shear. I am Allison Strand, or simply Strand. I used to have a birth problem that made me bald, but earlier today I got fused with a variety of hair-based powers. Try to stop me and you'll be torn asunder. I doubt that will happen, Strand, she replied as they started fighting. While they were fighting, Strand was attempting to constrict Sheer with the vice-like grasp of her hair. But due to her having bladed hands, Sheer successfully cut every last strand of her hair and left her bald again. After she lost her beloved powers, Strand was taken to prison until she was rescued by Tyranitar. After her escape, Tyranitar gave Allison a special treatment that recovered her hair, along with gaining the power to regenerate her hair whenever it gets cut again. Afterwards, Strand was assigned as the latest member of the villain team devoted to eliminating the heroic Madame Shear, the Scantily Six. The end. Well, guys, I hope you guys have a decent calculation of the story, and I apologize for the inconvenience. So, um, if you like the story and such, you could be able to... Uh, like and subscribe and comment down below. It's your choice after all. And I'll try all that I can to make proper calculations of storylines and such in the long run and such. So bear with me and it's Leviathan. And until next time, hope you guys are willing to be here next time and such. And hope you enjoy your time and such. In transmission.